All right, so I'm going to be showing you guys UKB Evolution version 2.1 on your Verizon HTC Droid Incredible 2. If you notice, you do get the little scroll effects. Let's go to About, Software Information, and see so you right there. Android version 4.0.3 and HTC Sense version 4.0. And then TSM UKB Evolution 2.1 and then some other stuff. Let's see what kernel this comes with actually. So this does come with the stock HTC kernel. So let's go back. Let's go back. And let's go back once more. You do get the developer options which are stock in Android 4.0. Um, let's see. You get the normal display, sound, you do get the personalize. Let's go to personalize real quick. Let's see what kind of skim, skins come with this. You have the default HTC and you have painting the world and spaceship earth. So if you want green maybe, I guess you can like apply the green and then change the wallpaper to match something else. Let's go back. Is that not focused? Then you can change your wallpaper and you can also change your scene from here. So if you don't like that scene, you can change it in there. And let's go back. Let's go to tweaks. I'm not sure why it's not showing up on the camera. Let's go to tweaks. You can support his Twitter and the ROM thread if you have any issues. You can change your quick settings. HTC power saver options. You got some phone info. If you don't like the HTC Sense lock screen, you can always choose the AOSP lock screen. You got your media controls, enable backwards, skip. And all those are blacked out, so you can't use them. In the power menu, you can have screenshot, airplane, mobile data, sound. Um, different tweaks that include over scroll color so you can change the color so if you want it to be blue and it says full re I don't want to reboot now and then also those that are kind of blacked out so and then you got the normal advance fix missions wipe your stuff things like that press and hold power you do get the power menu you can do get power off, restart, screenshot, airplane mode, on the network when you hit restart, you do get reboot, excuse me, hot reboot, recovery, and then you do get the bootloader. So you don't have to just reboot your phone, you can also reboot into everything else. So let's go back. And Wi Fi works, mobile data works. Everything pretty much works. Um, let's go to apps real quick. You do get you you do you get Chrome to phone, Flash Player, HTC locations. Um, you get SIM toolkit. You get Super User, Soundhound, um, Tweaks, TuneIn Radio. Those are just some of the stuff that's not you know stock HTC. The camera does work. Let's check out the camera real quick. Um, let me take a picture of. Let me take a picture of these chewy things. Oh, didn't mean to take that many. But the camera does work. Let's click on the picture. You see the camera focus is really good. The picture looks decent it did take more than one let's go back let's go back again show you guys the lock screen so lock it and unlock it you do get the stock HTC lock screen where you can lift the ring up or you can always drag something into the ring so if you wanted to quickly you know get to something stock phone it comes with the let me show you guys the stock HTC keyboard. 
but it doesn't have the um, arrows at the bottom. So I don't know if you guys like the arrows or not. I don't. And let me show you guys the boot animation. So let's go to restart. And let's go to reboot. That's the down animation. Wait for this to power back up. The lights are still on, so there we go. Should be off. Whoa, that just killed me inside. And it's turning back on. It comes with the HTC One boot animation. Oh, and this does include Beats Audio, by the way. So if you have a pair of headphones, I don't know where mine are. Actually, mine are on the floor, way over there. So. I can't get my headphones to show you guys. I wonder if I put this little headphone adapter thingy in there if it'll show. It's one of those ones. <laughs> yep, that just happened. That was my Nexus 7, my Galaxy Nexus, and my other phone going off all at the same time. My bad about that. Um. I got this little headphone adapter thing where it turns the one into the two. So if you want two people to listen to your headphones, I'm going to plug it in and see if it shows the HTC. Uh, let's see if we have any sound options. Sound. So yes, we do, you do have Beats Audio. So if you want to use Beats Audio, go ahead. Beats Audio does work on this ROM. And that's pretty much it for this UKB Evolution version 2.1 since 4.0 on your HTC Droid Incredible 2.